Hi, my name is Jason Mazur, and I'm a holiday addict. <laughs> it's, been a, it's been a little over two weeks since I celebrate my last holiday. <laughs> Ever since I was a child, I celebrated pretty much every holiday. It was educating holidays such as Diwali, Halloween, Thanksgiving, Valentine's Day, Hanukkah, and many, many others. I was even so desperate to celebrate more holidays that as a 100%, 100% Jewish man, I married a Catholic girl to get on some of that sweet Christmas action. <laughs> and it turns out all my friends were right. They were awesome. Santa's cool. <laughs> However great I thought those holidays were, I knew in my heart that it was wrong to have these feelings. I blame my school system growing up for killing my memories with these horrific celebrations. Growing up in the 80s and 90s, they had no cap on celebrations. None. It was like the Wild West out there. <laughs> I still remember the year on Halloween, or what we call it, Farmington. Super spooky, spectacular, fun fall festival day. <laughs> I went to school dressed up as a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle, Michelangelo. I entered the school day filled with excitement and emotion to show off my awesome new costume. But what came next, no one was to predict. I saw my supposed best friend dressed up across the classroom as none other than the evil Shredder. As you can imagine, it did not feel like an inclusive environment with the Shredder staring me down in my safe space in my classroom. Being in a public school, I definitely thought this was the type of situation that public schools should be intervening in. But because of the lack of inter intervention, I'm now a broken man. I'm filled with fear during October. Thanks during November, holiday spirit during December, and uncontrollable lust during February. These are all the types of celebrations and holidays and global citizens' days that can tear the moral fabric of a town apart. <laughs> and for that, I'm here today to thank and praise whoever's making the following policies that are harmful public schools possible as well as provide a few suggestions. Having only two celebrations per school year, great policy. However, in my opinion, there should be one, if not none, Allowed, this is an Avon where you can have Halloween parades every October, there are rules. <laughs> the banning of the use of any holiday name in the pharmacy school system. It is fantastic that children and teachers are fearful of using holiday names and emails, activities, or even muttering these diabolical celebrations. <laughs> Lastly, giving every kid what they always wanted for their birthday, the ability to donate a library book with their name in it. Forget cupcakes and singing like most of us used to have back in the day. <laughs> However, birthday stickers seem a little too celebration-y for my taste. How about send maybe a handshake and a nod to the librarian for their birthday? That'll keep those birthday spirits going all day. In summary, I hope every global citizen in this room has a great Thanksgiving, Merry Christmas, and Happy Hanukkah. <laughs>